Hey boys and girls, today we're going to talk about the circus. I want to go to the circus. Okay, so I don't really have these this thing late game. I kind of go to the more... Oh, I have one at least. I, I, I stick to the kind of the more, uh, you know, better <laughs> entertainment buildings. Though they're good for um, children and the very poor. Like, if you got a lot of poor areas, you can keep them in the poor areas, but don't keep them in your big tourist locations because they, you know, they, they're not meant for those spots. Anyways, so once you got one, uh, they look like this. I see this is a poor area and it's actually being being used well. Um, there's many different kinds though. You can change it to Beasts and Blood where visitors' uh, slots are decreased by one employee worker, uh, but the fees increase by two. So it's kind of like they like there are different shows. Wizard Magic uh, visitor slots are increased by one. Employed workers decrease service by uh, ten. Like it's weird. I wish they kind of just had different shows instead of hurting you for using different shows. Fire protection systems, 1500 bucks. Um, after a while, I always use this because I'm so sick of fires, they drive me nuts. Um, you know, you can go ahead and increase that budget. I give a full budget for this because I uh, I want people to be entertained and uh, you know, it's not really that much money. Might as well, and I only got one of them, so who cares, right? And uh, yeah, that's how I feel about uh, circuses. You don't need a whole lot in the end game, but they're nice to have in the beginning of the game quite early. Anyways, if this video helped you, please like it. And please remember, and I'm not even joking, don't subscribe to me. Subscribing is for losers.